क्लास सेवेंथ सब्जेक्ट जनरल साइंस चैप्टर सेवेंटीन इफेक्ट्स ऑफ लाइट एक्सरसाइज वन फिल इन द ब्लैंक्स ए वेन द बीम्स फ्रॉम द हेड लाइट्स ऑफ अ कार फॉल्स ऑन ऑब्जेक्ट इन द नाइट द शाडोज कॉल्ड अमरा एंड पेन्यूमरा कैन बी सीन बी ड्यूरिंग अ ल्यूनार एलिप्स द शाडो ऑफ द अर्थ फॉल्स ऑन द मून सी ड्यूरिंग अ सोलर एलिप्स द शाडो ऑफ द मून फॉल्स ऑन द अर्थ डी Various shades of color are seen in the sky at sunrise and sunset due to scattering of light. 2. Give reasons. A. Space beyond the Earth's atmosphere appears dark. Answer. There is a vacuum beyond Earth's atmosphere due to which there is no medium for scattering of light. As a result, space appears dark. B we are able to read while sitting in the shade answer the sun is an extended source of light which is far away from the earth the sunlight cast a shadow of the object in its path on the earth this shadow has no amra but penumbra which is nothing but the shade there is a sufficient amount of light available to read in the shade hence we are able to read while sitting in the shade c we should not observe the solar ellipse with naked eyes answer the earth receives the harmful ultraviolet rays from the sun during a solar ellipse even if brightness of the sun is less the ultraviolet rays reach the earth if the solar ellipse is seen or watched with naked eyes the ultraviolet rays directly enter our eyes and damage vision hence the solar ellipse should not be observed with naked eyes 3 give some example of scattering of light that we come across in day to day life answer 1 a beam of light emerging from a cinema projector on a screen 2 a beam of light emerging from headlamps of a car moving through a thick fog 3 the sun appears red at sunset 4 the sky appears blue 4 why is the shadow of a bird flying high not seen on the earth answer the sun is an extended source of light which is extremely bigger than the earth when a bird flies means at relatively shorter height from the ground there is a formation of amra and penumbra on the ground but as they fly high in the sky their amra becomes smaller and smaller and eventually disappears at the same time their penumbra becomes more and more fainter and then disappear as a result the shadow of the bird flying high is not seen on the earth 5 why is a penumbra not obtained from a point source answer scattering of light emerging from a point source does not take place thus only dark shadow of the object placed in front of the point source is obtained 6 answer the following questions in your own words a what is meant by scattering of light answer the light rays hit the molecules dust particles and other tiny particles present in the atmosphere and get scattered this phenomenon is called scattering of light when the scattered light rays enter our eyes we perceives the light a beam of light blue sky reddish appearance of sun are all effects of scattering of light B does the shadow really vanish in the zero shadow condition answer on the zero shadow day at noon the sun reaches exactly over our head thus the shadow of our body 
is a standing position means without stretching hands and legs is formed right below the base of our feet the shadow so formed is not seen and hence appears to be vanished c will the laser beam be seen if it passes through a glass box which contains a lighted incense stick answer scattering of light is required or necessary for a ray of light to be visible for this the light ray should get scattered on hitting the tiny particles in its path there are tiny particles of incense stick scattered in the closed glass box due to which the laser rays get scattered this scattered rays enter our eyes and the laser beam is seen 7 discuss and write a write a science based paragraph on what if the sun did not rise answer if the earth stops revolving the part of the earth opposite to the sun would never face the sun thus the sun would never rise at that part following are its effect or consequences one the part of the earth opposite to the sun would not receive sunlight that part would always experience darkness artificial sources of light would have to be used continuously for which a large amount of electricity would need to be generated two phenomena like solar ellipse zero shadow spectrum various shades of color in the sky would not be seen three temperature of that part of the earth would decrease extremely water present in the liquid state on the earth would freeze completely this would prove to be unfavorable for the living world four use of solar energy would not be possible five temperature of the part of the earth facing the sun would increase tremendously this would lead to so faster evaporation of water there would be no rainfall as a result plants as well as animal life would come to an end b what efforts will you make to remove the misconceptions about ellipses answer we will make people understand and accept the fact that an ellipse is a natural phenomenon like rain spectrum seasons for which we will take following steps one we will provide the scientific information about ellipses through various media two if an ellipse is going to take place in the near future we will create awareness about it through advertisement three we will give the experience to viewing an ellipse through spatial goggles and telescopes four we will arrange a tour to observe an ellipse taking place in the region far away from us five we will convince people that intake of food during the period of ellipse does not cause any ill effect on health c various ellipses and the conditions during that period answer 1 a solar ellipse the moon comes between the sun and earth in a straight line thus the shadow of the moon falls or cast on the earth a total solar ellipse one it is visible from within the part of the earth where the umbra of the moon falls two the solar disk is completely covered by the moon three darkness spread on the part of the earth where the shadow of the moon falls a partial solar ellipse one it is visible from within the part of the earth where the penumbra of the moon falls two the moon does not cover the solar disk completely an annual solar ellipse one it is seen or visible from the part of the earth where a very small portion of the umbra of the moon falls two it is seen that the part of solar disk except the peripheral ring is completely covered by the moon 
3, the edge of solar disk appears like an illuminated ring. 2. A lunar ellipse. The Earth comes between the Sun and the Moon in a straight line. Thus, the shadow of the Earth falls or casts on the Moon. A total lunar ellipse. At this event, the Moon completely comes in the shadow of the Earth. A partial lunar ellipse. At this event, a part of the Moon comes in the shadow of the Earth. 8. Explain differences a. Point source of light and extended source of light. Point source of light 1. A point source is tiny in size. Extended source of light 1. An extended source of light is bigger in size. 2. The amra is obtained from this source of light. 2. The Amra and Penumra are both obtained from this source of light. 3. Example Light coming from a tiny hole. 3. Example The sun, a torch. B. Amra and Penumra. Amra 1. The Amra is dark. Penumra 1. The penumbra is faint. 2. The umbra is obtained from a point source as well as an extended source of light. 2. The penumbra is obtained only from an extended source of light. 3. A total ellipse takes place from the part of umbra. 3. A partial ellipse takes place from the part of penumbra.